Greetings from Delhi Medical Association and Emedi News. Welcome to our show, Chat with Dr. K.K. We have with us Dr. Rajiv Bansal, an internist and practicing at Max Super Speciality Hospital. Thank you Hello, to be in our show. Thank you, sir. Uh, in the field of diabetes, we lot talk about lot about gliptins. Yes. Are they going to replace sulfonylureas in future? And what's new in the year 2013? Yeah. Uh, gliptins are the latest, uh, one of the latest entries into the uh, field of management of diabetes and gliptins are no doubt wonderful drugs uh, but as you ask that whether they are going to replace sulfonylureas, I have doubts uh, at least for next uh, decade or so. Uh, I am talking about in future. Uh, yes, maybe in future. I cannot that say. you have a combination of a gliptin with a metformin and, mm -hmm. and sulfonylureas will be out. Uh, sulfonylureas, there is, see, sulfonylureas have uh, history of now around 40 years, 40-50 years. So, at least for next 10 to 15 years, I cannot say whether they'll be out or not. Maybe in future, because sulfonylureas have certain drawbacks. They cause beta cell exhaustion. They have side effects. So they have cardiac side effects. They have other today. Side if effects. I have to start a person with a newly diagnosed diabetes, right. do I go for metformin or gliptin or both? Ideal combination is both. Ideal gliptin combination is both. Is both. And the paglutazone is totally out. Pyoglutazone is not totally out. Pyoglutazone again is a wonderful drug, but it has certain. Uh, we have to be cautious that it should not be given in cardiac patients, particularly with CHF. And low dose pyoglutazone has come up in some studies which are available. And which if I have to choose up. one gliptin, which one will you choose? Uh, all gliptins are same. All you gliptins are same. Almost all gliptins are same. And uh, what is the maximum dose of a gliptin when combined with metformin? Uh, if you are using cita gliptin, you can use 100 milligrams. So 100 mg of citagliptin with 1000 mg of, of metformin. metformin Not yes. more than that. You can give more. You can give metformin more. You can give separately metformin, one gram more. So you can give total of two grams of metformin and 100 grams of. So let me come of, away from uh, diabetes. Yeah. Uh, if you would not have been a doctor, what you would have become? Never thought about it. I think I would have uh, become a traveler. Traveler? You can yeah. still travel. Uh, but uh, you know, um, a travel agency, <laughs> or a travel agent, <laughs> uh, something related with traveling. Yes. Something related with the tra yes. travel industry. Exactly. Exactly. Uh, this gang rape incidents in the city of Delhi has yes. shaken the whole world. Yes, yes. not only India. Yes. Uh, yes. Uh, what suggestions you would like to give it to the government? I am not too sure whether the government uh, is should be uh, solely responsible for all this because this is this is a mindset of the society. You know, if we can change the mindset of the society by... See, you see, the way the public reacted, this cannot be the mindset of the society. Collective consciousness of the society is against it. So, therefore, it can be a mindset of a, a small segment of the society. Maybe, To yes. control that, what to do? Education? Yeah, I think education is the best Do you thing. feel that punishment is the answer or punishment and education both are answers? I think uh, punishment has to be, the, the law has to be tough so that a person who is doing this should think at least 10 times about this before doing any such act. The law has to be very strict. The, but the best thing is to educate the people regarding this, to change the mindset of that particular society. We feel that the, the first on contact is the police personnel, yeah. the first on contact. They should be taught first aid and cardiac first aid so that when they deal with the victims, they should be able to provide the first absolutely, aid. Absolutely, absolutely. I think they should Why be Why should given, they take 31 minutes to... They should be given all the paramedic uh, uh, training. And in fact, as a citizen also, we have certain responsibilities. It is often seen that when we see somebody on the road, we generally neglect and we just pass by. So I think it's the whole the responsibility of all of the society. So what Dr. Dr. Bansal says is very clear that in diabetes, we have lots of advances, we have newer drugs. These drugs do not act at the level of pancreas, they work at the level of GI. And the future is a combination of a metformin and a gliptin as the first line of therapy. Thank you, Thank you Rajiv, sir. to be with us. Pleasure. That's all for today. We'll come back with one more show. Till that, goodbye. Thank you.